President Nana Akufuado has returned home from his second phase of touring ECOWAS countries to formally introduce himself to them as Ghana's president. The six-day tour took him to Senegal, Guinea, and Cape Verde. Director of Communications at the Presidency, Mr. Eugene Ahin, described the trip as successful. Second phase of the president's tour was to introduce himself to ECOWAS countries and deepen bilateral relations with them. His tour also sought to give the assurance of his commitment to the ideals of ECOWAS. The president was welcomed back home by the vice president, Dr. Mahmoud Baumia, and other dignitaries. The director of communication at the presidency, Mr. Eugene Ahin, said while in Senegal, the president received highest national honor. An agreement was also reached to share ideas in the oil and gas sector. As we know, Senegal has discovered oil and gas in significant quantities. And President Makisal made a request of President Akufado to send a team from Senegal to Ghana to understudy the kinds of processes and the kinds of practices we have here with regards to our oil industry. Our last country was Cape Verde. Between their capital Praia and Accra, there are no direct flights between our country, our two countries. So the establishment of direct flights from Accra to Praia, the establishment of direct um, shipping links between our two capitals was also discussed. And to that extent, a permanent joint commission for cooperation has been established. Mr. Ahin said the president also reiterated his fight against Galamse. He means no words by saying that whatever it is, I mean it's illegal mining. There are people that are going about their businesses in terms of like legal small-scale mining, abiding by the regulations and all of that. There are people doing that, but illegal mining, no, he's made it clear. And to the extent that a cabinet subcommittee headed by Professor Frem Bombwating has been formed to, to virtually oversee the, 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 the clampdown on, on, on Galamse. And the president made it clear in Guinea that alternative sources of employment are being found or are being worked out. Ghana and some ECOWAS countries have formed joint commissions in the areas of energy and trade liberalization, among others. In order to ensure efficiency, the Deputy Minister for Foreign Affairs, Mr. Charles Oredu, has been appointed to chair all the joint commissions on cooperation to ensure that all agreements made are implemented.